We just uh, finished reviewing the financial records in the Treasury. Uh, what I saw was over 2,000 pages of jaw-dropping information. Uh, there's basically an enterprise wrapped around Joe Biden, uh, just a complete conglomerate of LLC shell companies where money was passing through from foreign countries, China, Ukraine, but many more countries than just those. There's a lot of information the American people deserve to know of the Biden family and the crimes they've been involved in. What's up, everybody? Major Retired Richard Ojeda here, and standing on the corner in downtown D.C., Marge the Trainwreck Green claimed to have seen 2,000 pages of alleged evidence against the Biden family. Marge was fresh out of just getting her rear end handed to her in committee over her idiotic misinformation regarding the coronavirus. Getting owned has been an ongoing situation for the Georgia Jackaloon. She has been getting humiliated on almost a daily basis, yet she is not deterred. And the Oversight Committee has a much bigger investigation to do than we ever thought was possible. Um, I just saw evidence of human trafficking. Uh, this involved prostitutes, not only from here in the United States, but foreign countries like Russia and Ukraine. Uh, this is this is unbelievable that a president and a former vice president, uh, not only his son, Hunter Biden, but many more family members extending past Hunter Biden and his immediate family. She's been drowned out with dog whistles in D.C. and run out of New York City, barely escaping with her bullhorn. So Tuesday's shenanigans are not surprising. The bottom line is that she is stupid. She's an absolute moron. She's making a mockery of the legislative process every time she opens her disgusting pie hole to spew conspiracies and lies. Uh, we're going to have to really get to work. This is an investigation that needs to be revealed to the American people. And not only do we have questions about Hunter Biden, himself, but this is going to extend into developing a web of uh, corruption, a web of fake companies uh, that's going to reveal money that came in from many foreign countries and went directly into the personal bank accounts of the Biden family, where they have financially benefited directly from Joe Biden's uh, seats of power. The latest garbage were allegations that the Biden family participated in prostitution rings in Russia. She absolutely did not bring up allegations of Donald Trump and his reported encounters with Russian hookers. She conveniently left out the Donald in a diaper photo and the reported golden showers that he was treated to in Russia. Marge is an absolute disgrace. She has called white men the most oppressed group in the United States, and the QAnon founder a patriot. She promotes smears that billionaire Democrat donor George Soros turned in his own people over the Nazis. She is a rabid moron that can't even count to 2,000. Who is she trying to fool? She didn't see stacks of evidence against Joe Biden because there isn't any. President Biden has run circles around that orange loser in his first two years in office. Maybe Marge saw the stacks of accomplishments that Joe Biden has made and couldn't handle the truth. Yet she continues to panhandle her crackpot agenda. She has had her head so far buried up Donald Trump's backside, her hair could be used for Donald's comb over. She is a national disgrace. From her space lasers to gazpacho police, she proves her incompetence daily. Marge is a conspiracy-loving clown, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is a fact. Sappers clear the way, airborne all the way.